Alright ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is for the third time today. If you like the video, like the video. Subscribe for more daily 2K content and let's get right into it. Man, look man, Mike Wong and the team, Ronnie 2K just tweeted out, want more? We got you right here, man. And we about to go right into it, man. We got so many videos. It don't matter what happened. We gonna keep dropping videos until there's no more information available. So do it. Whatever y'all do, man, like the video. Because it's the hardest working man in YouTube rocking with this thing, man. This stuff is so much news. And I'm so ready for next gen. They got me off of the, off of the uh, leader. I'm saying, yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the barbershop, BK of the People's Channel, coming to you live with another video, man. Look, man, listen. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. We got the news. It's coming up next. If y'all do nothing, swipe up, like the video, swipe back down, and keep it in full screen, scroll down, and like, whatever you gotta do, man. But rock with your boy, because I got more news for y'all right after this. Eno! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me a savage. Start hustling nonstop, don't plan on breaking that habit. All right, man, look, bro. This is just it right here. This is just what it is. Um, NBA 2K21 courtside report. Welcome to the city. That's that pastor try. It's the city. It's the city. It's the city. Well, man, look, we're going to try to get through this stuff as quickly as possible. My ugly mug is going to be up out of here most of the time, man. We're just going to go right through it. Or should I just put it up? Uh, or should I put it up up here so y'all can read it? But also, because y'all already seen the video, where it's going to go best? Right here? Right here, maybe? Right here? All right, we're going to put it right there, man. I was going to put it over my ugly mug, but, man, y'all need to see my excitement because I am Mr. Excitement in this joint, man. Look, a, a special hello to everyone in the NBA 2K community. Everin Born, I'm not going to butcher his name, executive producer and um, at Visual Concepts back again. We're roughly a week away from NBA 2K21 release on next gen. Blah, 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 yakety smack it. I can't believe it's basically... It's basically already here. Bro, do you know how I felt when I woke up Monday and I was like, yo, we just got one more week of this bullshit ass game, yo! That's what I was thinking, man. I know I'm yelling. A lot of people not used to my channel. They're gonna be like, you're yelling, blah, blah, blah. So far, these course side reports been dope. Blah, 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 yeah, I smack it. But first, a bit of history. We don't care about history. Look, look, backward never forward ever. That's what we saying, bro. We not going backwards, man. Um, Let me say, they, they, they say at the park, you know, they had, look, man, we don't care about none of that stuff. We did all this stuff. We saw the W online. We saw all this stuff. We want to know about the city. It's the city. It's the city. Well, lie, huh? Hey, look, man. Here it is. Here, uh, here is the city at a quick glance. Imagine a map that is uh, that is many, many times larger than the previous neighborhoods, a design that resembles a modern metropolis, uh, complete with a towering skyscraper, sprawling plaza, and a city center. That's gonna be dope. And, uh, and oh, and it houses, I thought I was gonna say it houses, and it houses districts, boroughs that are controlled by four uh, rival affiliations. And, um, and with that, I'm incredibly proud to announce that the affiliations are bike. Affiliations is bike. Ladies and gents, uh, let me see. I'll go more into detail. Blah blah blah. The city is the city is our most ambitious execution of virtual basketball community ever. The sheer amount of variety of the sheer amount of variety of the buildings and basketball courts that that we that we were able to create and fit into the map still amazes me today. Let's talk about it. Look, bro. Look. Somebody was talking about it in the comment section. They were talking about how you know this is gonna be crazy because you got um. Just because of the fact that you're gonna have, I think this will go better down here, which I'll, it goes beside me right here. Yeah, let's put it beside, nah, let's try. I don't know where to put it at, man. Right, let me just leave it where it was. Make it like it was. Anyway, um, somebody was talking about, but look, like I said in the previous video, the sheer processing power of this of these machines and the new servers, coupled with all of that, see, you, we're not just getting new machines. The, the, the this All this stuff is gonna be backed up by new servers with new, all new technology, all new architecture, all of that. So we're going to have the power of the cloud powering this stuff on both PlayStation and Xbox. Service should be fine, and your PlayStation and or Xbox with the power that it's gonna get with the new APUs, this should be more than capable of powering all this. is not going to be like the neighborhood in previous iterations where we didn't have enough processing power. Like I said in, in, in earlier, 
processing power is not always about more graphical fidelity. Most of the time, it's just running stuff behind the scenes, and that's what this is. That's what this appears to be. Rookie Bill sitting. Uh, let me see. Sitting just off the water on the southern side. On the southern side of the uh, of the city, like lies the Rookieville docks. Rookieville is an, is exactly what it sounds like. This is where your NBA 2K uh, 21 city journey will begin. Uh, in, uh, my players looking to dive into the city, and and all that is uh, and all that it has to offer must first prove their skills amongst rookie players in the isolated cluster of basketball in this isolated cluster of basketball courts meet the requisite meet the i guess i was gonna say prerequisite meet the requisite actions in rookieville and the gate of the city will open before you uh let's find out what awaits you on the other side let's find out what awaits you on the other side burrows as noted above affiliations make it uh, affiliations are making their return a long way to return the NBA 2K21. Each has a dedicated space north side, east side, west side, south side city, uh, south uh, of this section of the city. Uh, we refer to as boroughs. Each borough has its own vibe and collection of basketball courts. Decked, uh, uh, let me see, basketball courts decked out in affiliation logos. Uh, additionally, each affiliation area houses a unique warehouse basketball court where new my player progression features await hmm interesting a uh, warehouse back because i saw the warehouse and i was wondering like what is that gonna be about man but it says where, where new my player progression features await uh more on that below so we're gonna find out about that the event center the heart of the city ain't no love in the heart of the city i said ain't no love in the heart of town boy i've got ooh, they got me singing this oj easy mic today man look the event center the heart of the city is the brand new event center uh shining like like uh like a bright beacon no matter which borough you view it from uh equally bright and shiny uh are many of the different interiors of the futuristic monolith where the court floors and walls are lined up, are lined with dynamic LED screens and lighting elements that change the tone and vibe of the set. All new and all new and returning events will be held inside the event center, a, and special intra affiliation competitions will be uh, will take place there as well. So that's that's robbery day, man. If you if you can't read between the lines, bro. But hey, I ain't gonna lie, what I said ain't no. Boy, ain't no love in the heart of the city on robbery day. That's how it gonna be. Ain't no love in the heart of the city, man. Let me see. Garage hoops. Uh, let's see. Exploration is a major part of experiencing the city. Sprinkled in, uh, uh, of the city. Sprinkled around the city, you'll find basketball hoops attached to the side of of some buildings. If you look close enough, if you happen to see one. Try pulling out your basketball and shooting some hoops with it. Hmm. If you, if another player passes by and sees you shooting, they will be they'll have the ability to step on uh, step on the court and shoot with you. Uh, from there, you will be, you will have the option to quickly and seamlessly launch a one on one, two on two, or three on three, a horse and many. Uh, okay, so this seems cool. Instead of having your your apartment or whatever, it's, it looks like it's like you're just gonna be able to find different hoops and do all those things you would do. So we just find a hoop in the city and we can get it, we can run it up. That sounds pretty dope. Um, it's simplicity in it's simplicity. It's simplicity is its strong point. And as an added bonus, and as an added bonus, there are large VC multipliers you can earn on these courts uh, each day for. Uh, for the first five games played. Okay, so they're giving you incentive to play on the court. This is a great place to start your day off and warm up. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. They're giving you incentive to play on there uh, to warm up uh, for the main event at your affiliation or uh, at your affiliation court. People of the city. Uh, let's see what we got. People of the city. Continuing on with the with the theme of exploration scattered throughout the city. Uh, our our quest objects giving NPCs quest slash object. Uh, objective giving NPCs. So you got NPCs throughout the city. So everybody in the city is not a real person. That's dope. Uh, this is just like like an RPG, and that's what it's gonna say. If you ever played an RPG, uh, uh, played any RPG experience, you'll have no problem spotting them. 
uh, they will they will be the people with colored exclamation points above their heads. Every four to six weeks, new quests slash objectives will be added to our uh, to our people of the city, such that such that you will find yourself uh, with the new things to do all year long. So they're really investing in the longevity of the game. I'm liking this, man. It really comes down to how the game gonna play. Uh, generally speaking, there are two lines of quests. The first is the first is a series of single player 3v3 games. Uh, you will you will play challenge. You will, you will be challenged with the warehouses found in the in the court uh, area of each affiliation. Some of these can be pretty challenging, and you'll and you'll be facing off against some of the best players to ever lace up the pair a pair of basketball shoes. The insides of the warehouse are actually very cool. Astute players will astute players who enjoy NBA 2K20's neighborhood uh, will appreciate the throwback efforts within. So are we gonna have like River City uh, inside the warehouse or what? Uh, there, the other line of the other line of quest will encourage you to get out and play games uh, in the city and rewards you. Bro, this is so much content. How to complete quests. Your boy will have those. Subscribe now for more daily 2K content. 2K heat every day of the week, man. We got this so much content for content creators. That's what it is for me. I don't care. Uh, the other line of quests will be encouraged, will encourage you to get out and play games in the city and reward you for and reward you for doing so. Simple as that. Complete all the quests and you will earn some unique clothing, items, uh, accessories that are not that are not sold in the stores. Get out there and ball with your friends. Gatorade training facility, the mecca of the mecca of my player physical training. Get some makeover uh, uh, and multiple letter uh, and multiple levels. Literally, the facility has the facility has now expanded to two floors. Uh, where where on the first floor, my players will find the usual array of training equipment that'll help beef up uh, that'll help beef up beef up their abilities. The second floor houses a great new feature in the city: rental courts. Want an uninterrupted run of games with your friends or ballers? Our ballers you just met, rent a court in the Gatorade facility and play games however you want. That's going to be dope. I wonder how, uh, number one, I wonder how much that's going to cost to rent the court. Number two, I got to be the spoiler. Um, we really want to know, are you going to get rep off of that? Because some of these games where people can just walk up and play and do stuff like that, no, man. You're getting real boosty out here, man. You know what I'm saying? You got your bitch, she got a boosty A on. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. She gonna have it on. That's all I'm saying. Special courts. Uh, special courts. There are a couple of full size. Well, I'm sure they'll fix it if 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 they if if they comes to that. I'm sure. Uh, there are a couple of full size. Uh, full size. One. Uh, well, one four on four. The other five on five courts available in the city. These are non-affiliated uh, courts that are ours. That are ours that our team created to pay tribute to the two things we were very passionate about. One of these, one of these courts was built to commemorate and celebrate the late Kobe Bryant and the late great Mamba, Kobe Bryant, that's what I'm gonna say. And the, uh, the, surface is, the surface is textured beautifully with the Kobe signature sneakers, I mean, snake skin design and his eight and 24 mark. The, re uh, the, res the restricted area at the opposite ends of the, um, it's in the restricted area, the opposite ends of the court. And, and overlooking the grounds is a gigantic mural of an iconic Kobe moment. Well, you know, that's when he won the championship and, and did the whole thing. They just popped up on the screen right there. Hey, Mamba, I know you watching down on, on these people man hey thank you thank you my dude. you man you know y'all know how i love kobe man y'all know i'm a kobe fan damn i got all the stuff look look at all this kobe stuff i got i got the kobe mouse pad right here man i got the don't i got the uh yeah hold on man let me let y'all know it's serious around here man look at that it's serious around here when it comes to Kobe, man. I ain't playing with y'all. I got Kobe mouse pads and all that. I made them. If you want me to make you one, uh, holler at me. I can definitely make it for you in the store. BreezeTees.com. Link in the description. But anyway, we serious when it comes to Kobe around here, man. I ain't gonna cap. And them Lakers. Um, my mama was a Lakers fan when I grew up. That's why I'm a Lakers fan. But anyway, um, opposite ends of the court. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I can just smack it away there triumphantly. Uh, let me see. You won the fifth championship. Yes, that's right. I know. I know you all are are picturing the pose. Um, let me see. What are you thinking? What are you thinking is correct and immortalized right here in uh, 2K21 in the city. This is the location where you will find where you will find me playing as I celebrate my Lakers 
Laker and Kobe fandom. Exactly, because I'm going to be on that court. Fives in the park, fours back in the park, question mark. Let's get it. Fireball, holding court. Holding court in the uh, in the city is going to is going to come with an air of prestige in the next gen version of NBA 2K. On occasion, you will see a fireball being used on the courts. Yes, literally a ball that is on fire where you where your where your team will win ten games in a row on affiliation courts. Uh, on affiliation court, the ball is used. Uh, in the game will immediately catch on fire and stay lit until you lose. That's dope. Uh, expect crowds to gather around your court uh, when this happens. You already know the av you already know that everyone seeing the fireball will be like be like a bat uh, it will be like a bat signal for the best ballers to start lining up uh, to dethrone you. That's how it used to be, man. When you went on the street in 2K16, it was like that to the point where it was damn near annoying. Go on a five street, go people coming out there just to beat you and that's what i like man but hopefully we do that it ain't okay just for y'all to run to pink diamond flags are one of the favorite basketball courts uh court designs in the next gen game atop the pink diamond plaza uh located it located right in the heart right next to the heart of the city uh decked out in fluorescent lights and with music orchestrated by by a resident DJ, uh, Pink Diamond Plaza hosts the entire the entirety of the My Team Triple Threat online experience. Give it a look. Okay, so we saw that part, and you got you know you got Zion out there. Apparel and shoes. Uh, apparel and shoes. While some of while some of your favorite shops from the neighborhood will be returning, the city has built uh, has been built to feature an even wider variety of apparel locations for your express. Uh, for you to express your style, uh, some of the closest brands, some of the closest brands partners will be receiving a dedicated space uh, within the plaza of the shops. All of your favorite include all of your favorites, including Nike, Jordan, Adidas, Under Armour, Puma. Y'all know I'm a Puma guy all day long, man. Check it out. Boy, I got, I got these Puma. I got Pumas, man. You know what I'm talking about? These Puma running shoes. Bye. I, I done messed them up. I got to get me some more, but them the only shoes I done wore. They got the comfort foam in them. I done wore them. This is the only shoes I done wore since uh, February, no cap, because this whole pandemic started. And then I've been shut in, like sick and shut in. Y'all, blessings for the sick and shut in. But anyway, uh, and many more can be found in the city. For me, two of my favorite new stores are the Alter Ego and the Drip Brothers. I knew I hadn't seen Drip Brothers before. Uh, you can get some of the, you can get some fun items in those, in those two. Be on the lookout for all of the new self uh, self expression items we will have available on on lunch at lunch and beyond. So you know you got Adidas. We got the Puma store, like I said. That's what I, that's what I'm digging. We got Converse, New Balance, Alter Ego, affiliations. The big the city is big. The return of affiliations. Uh, the return of affiliations, however, may be just as however may be just as big if not bigger for some years now one of the one of the most requested features from from the 2k community has been a, a affiliation based gameplay naturally we're incredibly excited to bring it back uh in a meaningful way that offers uh competition depth competition competitive depth to the city this is some this is something we have wanted to do for a number of years now and the and the power of the next gen console finally affords us the opportunity uh, to see us uh, busying it through. Uh, let's see. Let's start with the basics. Here are the four affiliations. North, North Side Knights, like we said, South City Vipers, Beast of the East, West Side, Western Wildcats. I'm joking. You know, I, it's just fun to say West Side. Every time I win a game, I'm going to be like, West Side! I ain't even joking with you. That's all the, you know, that's all the stuff in their little city halls. Uh, each each has their own dedicated borough and set of affiliation affiliation courts uh, within within the city. Rep up, rep up the Pro One by winning a few games in Rookieville, and you'll be assigned to, to one of these four rival factions. What? You'll be assigned? The hell no! I can't be assigned. I need to choose. Y'all, uh, 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 uh. you can know I need to be able to choose because I need to be able to play with my people, man. I don't 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 do me like that. Um. Anyway, you'll be assigned to one of the four. If you didn't land, if you didn't land in your affiliation of choice, you can always head to City Hall of the affiliation you are interested in, interested in join, and file um, and file a transfer request. The penalty for changing your affiliation is your rep level will be reset all the way down to Pro One. So I mean that's cool. So like if I don't get it the first, like I don't get what I want. They don't give me West Side Wildcats, then I'll just I just I'll just change it right there and then I just be pro one. Uh what you had what you had 
me see what you had when you graduated from Rookieville. I would encourage you to think a long, long and hard before abandoning your your team to jump ship. So why would so who will who will run the city? Uh, so who will run the city at the core of the affiliation game play rivalry and uh, competition is rivalry and competition. It's it's versus uh, it's us versus them. Who will be the best? We've decided we've designed this experience to be an an ever present. Grapple, uh, grapple amongst the Knights, Vipers, Beasts, and Wildcats for bragging rights within the city. Here is what's here is what's in play uh, for the respective affiliation player rep. Playing, playing on your own affiliation courts has its advantages. Specifically, you can you can only achieve your full player rep by balling on your home court. What? You can only achieve your full player rep by okay playing on courts on the rival on on your rival affiliation will earn you much less rep per game played. Leveling up and strengthening your my player will be very key uh, for what is to come. Why 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 I gotta get half the player rep? Like so if you wanna rep up and you wanna you wanna be max rep you're gonna be stuck in your park bro like if you want to go to the grind the legend you, you kind of stuck in your park oh okay it is what it is though we'll see robert day conquest the final two weeks of each of every mayoral term uh mayor term more on this below will be featured and it will, will be will feature the culmination of a series of events to crown which affiliation runs the city uh rival day conquest is a key is a key event where all where all rep earnings uh, restricts rep earning restrictions are removed from the city. Okay, so now that makes sense. Raw rep rep earning restrictions are removed from the city, and you are encouraged to invade every other borough um, in your uh, borough with your teammates and take control of the other courts. So that's cool. So the last two weeks, uh, so for for one month, you got to stay in your city if you want to get max rep, and then for the last two weeks, you can travel and still get max rep. It is what it is. Uh, keep a close eye on the leaderboard located in in each arena, uh, in each area at the end of rival day. At the end of rival day conquest, the four affiliations will be ranked ranked by score and seeded for the culmination um, of the season. The rival day championship, rival day championship, taking place in the in the event center. This is this will be the final piece of the puzzle, confirming your affiliation as the true champions of the of the uh, city. Battle head to head with the team for with the teams from other affiliations as you as you engage in the uh in this culminating experience for the affiliation uh for the affiliation that comes out on top in this head-to-head -head championship the spoils of the city await you uh you'll be able to you'll be able to head to your affiliation city hall and pick your winners uh pick up your winners check up enjoy the free vc but the real prize is your mayor will be able to uh will also be able to deck out your entire borough and make and make your affiliation the envy of the city so every six weeks Somebody winning rivalry day, bro. That's dope. This is one of the second. This is the second time I mentioned uh, this concept of mayors. Uh, let's do, let's dive and take a closer look at what the mayor at what the mayor is and what he will do. Mayors, a brand new dynamic we are introducing as part of the uh, as part of the city are mayors. Each affiliation will be will be represented as a mayor. They will they will be very influential in your day to day experiences uh, with the city. So what so what is a mayor? And what do they do? And how do they become elected? We're gonna get into all of that. Let's go over all the responsibilities of a mayor. Uh, affiliation videos. Mayor will be, the mayors will be creating assorted videos during their term that will appear in game on the on the jumbotrons in, in the city court areas. Could you imagine me a brute with the daily news, with the news on the jumbotron? Why? Hey, so Illuminati really would have been the king of Sunset. Fredo really would have been the king of Rivet or something like that. Bro, is Fredo coming back? Question mark? I don't know. Uh, you can expect your mayor to admit to uh, to admit rallying cries and motivate the teams of the uh, of the affiliation to perform at the part um, and to perform at the peak of their abilities. After all, like you, um, after all, like you, they want to run the city. They want to run the city, of course. Uh, custom playlist mayors can mayors can curate custom uh, music playlists that only play within their prospective boroughs. That's dope. Uh, this is actually a great feature in the um, in that each affiliation. Uh, each affiliation court area will have its own vibe 
and uh, yeah, that's gonna be dope. I'm not gonna read all of that. And as you move away from the court area, you will hear the music slowly fading away. Uh, simultaneously, you as you approach a new court area, you'll hear the uh, the beats even louder from that other area. Okay, let's do court design. There will be there will be events during the mayor's the mayor's reign where if where if the affiliation comes out victorious, they will have a they will have the responsibility of designing what the courts look like uh, look like for the borough. Will they will they choose a thematic design that represents the mascot? I don't know. Will they just ask for Lakers courts? Hey, might do that. They need to be they need to be thinking re-election, uh, re-election here with the, with every design made. But it's gonna be dope. Mural design, like uh, like court design above. They will they will be there will be opportunities for affiliations to to customize the look of their court areas with highly stylized murals that really set the tone uh, for the for the for the location when rival players come to visit so you know if you want to put the fear the fear of god in them you got to put you got to do something uniform selection when it comes to time to formally battle uh, the other affiliations head to head the mayor will be the unique uh, will have the unique, unique opportunity to select the uniform that all members will wear as the as they as they stream uh, onto the courts uh, for the rivals dressing dressing for success will be the order uh, order here elect me as mayor and we're gonna come out there with suits I promise you red shiny suits or blue whatever we got a uh, rivalry day will be will be monumental periods of the uh, monumental periods of time during the season let me see what we get 26 minutes mayors will also be interacting with the with their with their constituents via in-game polls and uh, messages that are that is convenient uh, conveniently built in directly uh, into the menu system uh, in 2K. Thank y'all for putting stuff out there. Finally, let's talk briefly about how mayors come to be. For the launch of NBA 2K, we have hand selected the initial candidates for mayors. Uh, spoilers: they will be some of the biggest names uh, from the from the NBA 2K community. You know all of them. Uh, Mayor Brute? Question mark. You know, uh, these these four these four big time uh, mayor mayor uh, smooth mayor Chris smooth question mark mayor Fredo mm, no one of them might be uh, let me see these are the four these are the four big time community influencers will be will be leading the charge for the mayor program but these positions aren't permanent every six weeks we will be holding an election uh, we'll be holding an election week in the game where you the community represent your affiliation we will have we will have final say on who becomes the next mayor to represent the case cause uh so yeah they probably that's cool because you can vote on it but they're not gonna just be like like if it's somebody that's got a bad rep in the community like me or something they probably not gonna let me be mayor i'm gonna be too vocal i mean that's cool though I mean, I'm, I'm with it though these are going to be the exciting times that 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 can turn the tides and more and and momentum we have we have some we have some fun ideas in store to make selection week fun and memorable stay tuned that's gonna be dope uh my player with the map with the map of this size our our objective is to uh our objective was to populate it with as many ballers as possible as possible to make to make it truly vibrant and dynamic uh we're supporting hundreds of players simultaneously in the city i don't know how this gonna work but they can always cut it down here's what's Here's what's new for everyone in them. The main thing is gonna be cool, man, because if people are in the city, they can go to these parks and we can play and get games. So as long as it doesn't impact gameplay, I'm all for it. Uh, walking and balling at the same time. The basketball is an integral experience in the city. Yes, we have lots of different balls uh, for you to express yourself with. You will be, you will need to have have uh, one of your inventory to participate in the aforementioned Gatorade court rentals. So you got to get to you got to buy your ball in order to do that. So it's just gated behind the ball. That's cool. Um, let me see in garage hoops games. Uh, easily, easily my favorite usage of the basketball is the simple act of dribbling around the court, uh, uh, dribbling around the city whenever I want to. Bro, I used to dribble around. Uh, I went to the University of South Carolina. I had a basketball in my book bag. I dribbled everywhere. People thought I was crazy. I would dribble to class, go to class, and go straight to the gym because I was at the Schwerenzer building because I was in engineering, and I would come up from the Schwerenzer building. I had my, my, my clothes in my backpack, go change, play with my play, play the game, and then go home, do my homework and all that stuff, man, because I lived in the towers, but hey, it is what it is. Um, but you know, anyway, let's let's keep going. Garage Hoops games, easily, easily one of my better whenever I want. Like the brand new dancing system uh, described above. Let me see what I got 
uh, you will you will be able to. Hey, let me know down below if you made it this far and if you used to walk around with your basketball. You should sleep with the basketball. You will be able to, to um, you'll be able to showcase your style with the real time change. Uh, I guess a chaining together of way of of wealth of dribble moves, so you can dribble off court with the basketball. The dynamic, the dyn, the dyn, dynamism. I guess in the system, the, the dynamic, the dynamism. I can't even say the word in the system is, is uh, this year is truly offers the offers you a chance to create a unique and custom showcase of dribbling, uh, dribbling the ball. One little tip for you: somewhere out there in the city is a citizen who can teach you some of the uh, some of the best dribble moves around. Stizo is an NPC? Question mark. I knew he was too damn good at the game. Uh, you just have to find him. Skateboard BMX, one of the favorite improvements. So the experience will be uh this year falls into the into the category the skateboards bmx uh toys joys uh, uh the joys of traveling the city for the thrill seekers out there you will be you will find uh you will find plenty of rails you can grind on with the skateboard see i don't be missing nothing uh yeah that's right express your style and grind on the rails grinding df question mark uh let's see and uh rails you can and you can find uh rails you can find in the city there is a very large hill in the in the Beast of the East borough and features the longest rail grind in the city. Have fun with have fun with that one. Um oh, one more thing. There is a free fully kitted out there's a free fully kitted out skateboard waiting for you in the decks. Our skateboard shop. Make sure make sure to stop by and pick it up uh so you can partake in the fun. I wonder how much this joint going to cost. BMX Look, we had we always seen bikes never really wore them except for their low rider, their uh, Big Mac B ride. The, if the BMX bike has has also seen a lot of improvements uh, to its functionality and control this year. Aside from being one of the fastest vehicles in the city, it now allows you to perform a variety of tricks uh, tr tricks to show off your style. Land a 360, 360 out this mug, and you'll and you'll get everyone's attention. Let's see. I want to can you fall? That mean you can fall off too though. Uh, it's, I should probably note that the skateboard also has its own set of tricks that you can perform in addition to the newly added gr uh, grinding uh, grinding ability. One of the new vehicles is uh, the one of the new vehicles. The chopper is a great way to flaunt your style. Uh, it's not the fastest bike, but it's not it's not supposed to be. Uh, the one this one is all about looks and catching the attention of everyone around you. I'm a fan of all the different looks available uh, available here. Most, uh, most, uh, more on the way. This game will never stop growing on you. Now with all of this stuff, bro, I feel bad because I want like the females should be able to be in the game. They got all this stuff. Why the females can't be in the game? You know what I'm saying? Cosmetics creating, uh, cosmetics creating a specific look for your my player has been one uh, one half of an important uh, equation in making in making your my player really yours. In the in the next generation, will we have better face scans? Did y'all steal the one that that uh, live got? I hope you did because that was the dopest one. Uh, in next gen version of 2K, we're opening up with new customization elements uh, to help you look look right. Hey, this is one of the this one is definitely uh, you know big. We're offering a number of a new. Oh, they got more hairstyles, uh, accessories. Rep your affiliation with the latest accessories. Make sure you hit the em, hit up embellish one of the many stores in the city where you can pick up some chain uh, chains and necklaces. Okay, embellish apparel. Uh, we've got we've got some we got some surprises, uh, some surprise items in store, including the new uh, including the new types of of hats spoiler i've seen the upcoming wacky hats and they are my all-time favorites uh clothing footwear and and more for lunch for lunch head to the affiliation store and 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 mask up with a custom face mask that uh that only people within the affiliation can sport that's gonna be dope uh so that's why the covid mask is on there like that uh it's important to stay safe out there and as always we'll be uh, we'll continue bringing uh we'll continue bringing the gear to freshen up yep and the closing thoughts uh here visual concept blah 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 you know we showcase the, the flagship game all that good stuff 2020 has been a challenging year uh from our home to yours look man look bro it looked dope man I, i'm not about to waste no more of y'all's time man the main thing is affiliations and stuff like that i read the whole article so you don't have to you can read the introduction and all that good stuff man but i just really feel like this is gonna be a dope game and my biggest thing is 
the, the, the everything surrounding the game is perfect. Give us the gameplay. If you, if you, like you can't have this and then we got speed boost glitch, demigods, and, and, and you know what I'm saying, all that out the gate, but we gonna talk about that in another one. This is a video for video for celebration. I appreciate what y'all do, Mike. You guys really hit it out of the park this time. I appreciate it. And hopefully uh, we gonna really enjoy this game. A lot of content creators to grow. I see a lot of things in here that that will allow content creators to grow. Even if you get on the mayoral ballot, you're, you, you got a chance to grow, man. You can really come up and do some things in the community. All you got to do is just be on the ballot. You ain't even got to win. But uh, we're going to check it out, man. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Town. Guys, please.